Hi everyone, and thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you're doing well and feeling ready to learn about Hollywood's favorite meat-eating dinosaur, the Tyrannosaurus rex, also known as the T-Rex. And just to reiterate, that's pronounced Tyrannosaurus rex. Let's go ahead and get into this video. The first partial skeleton of the Tyrannosaurus rex was discovered in Hell Creek Formation, Montana, USA in 1902. And since, a lot of its remains have been found throughout North America. The Tyrannosaurus rex existed during the Cretaceous period, a long period that lasted from around 145 and a half to 65 and a half million years ago. More specifically, the T-Rex roamed Earth about 67 to 65 million years ago, making it one of the last non-avian dinosaurs to exist before their extinction. The Tyrannosaurus rex was a massive dinosaur. For many years, it was considered the biggest carnivorous dinosaur. The largest one to date measured 40 feet long and 15 feet tall. Although dinosaurs like the Spinosaurus have since been found to be bigger, it was the largest predator that roamed during its time. What really stands out about the T-Rex is its massive size and that's part of the reason why I was given the name Tyrannosaurus rex. The name means Tyrant Lizard King. The Tyrannosaurus rex comes from the family Tyrannosauridae, which were dinosaurs that tended to be larger in size. And some of the prominent characteristics include that they were theropods, which is a category given to carnivorous dinosaurs. And they were bipeds, meaning that they walked on two legs. The T-Rex experienced growth that was a lot more drastic than other Tyrannosauridae. Scientists have examined fossils from different growth stages, and they found that the T-Rex changed drastically around the age of 18 in terms of size. This means that the Nanotyrannus, which has been considered a different species of dinosaurs, could have been an adolescent T-Rex. Other features that it had were its powerful jaws, and its mouth contained teeth up to 12 inches long. In addition, the T-Rex had small arms with only two digits. An interesting theory I read was that they had smaller arms because arm muscles are in competition with neck muscles, and the T-Rex needed strong neck muscles to hold up its massive five foot long head. It is believed that the Tyrannosaurus rex lived in environments like coastal swamps or open forests close to water sources, and there they could hunt a variety of animals like the Edmontosaurus or the Triceratops, and possibly other Tyrannosaurus rexes. There have been T-Rexes found with other T-Rex teeth embedded in their fossils, which could mean they fought amongst each other, hunted one another, or the more probable explanation is that they ate T-Rex remains while scavenging. Some scientists believe they operated primarily on scavenging considering the fact that they had short arms which could make it difficult to pin down their prey. However, they had powerful jaws which could inflict serious damage and they could pursue their prey with their powerful and long legs which allowed them to sustain speeds of around 20 miles per hour. Today, we learned a few facts about the Tyrannosaurus rex. I hope you found this information very beneficial. The T-Rex is a fun dinosaur to see in movies, but some of the things I mentioned today, you may not have known. If you feel driven to find out more, there are a lot of resources on the internet where you can learn. I've even attached the links I use for research in the description below. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more content. And in the comments section, let me know what dinosaur you want to see for the next video. Thanks you all, and until next time.